We're back on EC 2015 and we are using the wheel cam today. So yes, we are in the garage and we're about to buy the Bet Customs F132. You already know what I'm going to do with this video. I'm going to drive it with a wheel. Now, there's one big problem I figured out with the PC version. Now, in the console version, there is a setting to basically allow you to set something or that set the cars to manual or automatic. Now, the only way to get this thing to run in manual is to do a drag race. So they need to... They, they need to fix that. But let's go for the first time through... What the blood? All right, that looks pretty sick, to be quite honest with you. Look through some of these wraps which are created by the PC players. And I think I may have just found the one we're going with, but we'll keep looking. And there we are. I think that looks freaking amazing. But without further ado, you've already seen the customization. If you want to see the customization, go back to the previous video. Where I already made a build on it and everything. But... Let's go drive it. So as you can see through the controls menus, there's just no way to change this car to manual. There's literally, that's that's the most frustrating thing about this because I would love to try this fully manual with a wheel, but we're going to try with a wheel anyway. Let's see how this hot rod, I, I already tried to shift there, but we're going to see how this thing handles because it is so unique. It is the most unique handling car on the game. Look at it go. <laughs> Oh my god, okay, turn, turn, shit! I remember first getting in this thing and being like, what the actual hell is going on? Now it's at 60 frames a second with a wheel without manual. I feel a bit naked if I'm honest with you. I don't, no, it needs, it needs some, it needs the manual control. And especially, especially when I know for a fact that people are going to start putting in the HGate shifter support. I, I don't think it supports it as of now. Um, I tried it myself at the beginning, it didn't work. And I imagine it's a simple mapping job if you, you know, set up a wheel as a controller kind of thing and that sort of stuff. But we'll get into that in the future when I have the time. But as I said, for now, I really just wanted to drive this thing. Widow. It's the boom boom! It's alright. With this, with this vehicle, you basically lose them just like that. Like, I've already lost them. <laughs> They've gone. Initial impressions with the wheel and the hot rod, how does it feel? It actually feels about the same if I'm honest the hot rod as you probably know if you've played it on any platform it's the most unique handling car in the game it just it handles completely differently to everything else but with the wheel it feels the same as every other car now one thing I've noticed well it is obviously somewhat different but I'm talking about like how the, the control is one thing I've realized is that with this car on any platform you have you can turn a lot easier and stuff and I think I don't think it has as much auto steer as everything else I may be wrong I'm just guessing here from how I'm, how, how I'm you know receiving the, the input I don't know it feels as if this feels how most of the other cars feel on this version it doesn't feel that special except it's bloody quick oh my god oh my god I feel like I'm gonna crash any second through here and thank god they muted the bloody phone call option was added to the game because otherwise she would be ringing me 24 7 because cause she loves me it, it would love this face apparently the hot rod doesn't <laughs> so unfortunately i don't have the longest drag event available because i haven't looked at the hard events yet i don't think let's progress throughout the whole day to get to be able to show you this so taught me a bit of effort but we're here i don't know if you can get save data if you can get save data I'm going to like a bit of a prat, aren't I? So how is, it? is this an easy one? I think this is an easy one. So what we're going to do is go for this medium one because it'll be around in the middle. So obviously with this event, we should have manual with this car. Now, again, it's just going to be a straight line event, so it's not really going to matter. But it's still something I really just want to try, especially because, well, they've been added to the game today. So let's warm up the tires and the horror. I'm slowly moving. There we go. If I just correct the wheel a little bit. There you go. So, oh, shit. I, I wasn't picked. For God's sake. Black confetti. You ain't ready for this. Performer burnout. Here we go. It's, it's, it's just way too much power. It's just moving. It's like, unlike every other car, it just doesn't move. We're on good. That's all we need. Let's see how we do. We've got manual gears this time, so it's going to be freaking interesting, and go, 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 here we go, oh my god, oh my god, okay, this feels so much cooler now, feels so much cooler to use it with the, the shifter on this, I, I hope Ghost actually add this feature in, like, the, I'm thinking, like, if they don't, someone else is going to add it in, we got the tools where the camera could free around, you can have damage disabled in the world. It's going to be an option. It might only be an option, I might have missed it, but that with the, my god, that was freaking fun. 
and now we just need it with the proper shifter, which I've, I've pushed down because I don't need it. Advantage of the new the new add-on from uh, Wisdom Pro. Thanks, Wisdom Pro. You're... Cheers, lads. And now I feel naked again. I need to shift gears, man. I need to shift it. You can't, you can't take that off from me. I've been... I've not used automatic and use speed for the ages, except for when I'm like doing the one-offs in videos. But I don't, I don't use it now. The manual's here, and now you're forcing me. I, f I feel naked. It still has that extra turnability with the wheel, but I think honestly, it actually seems to turn better with a controller. I don't know. It might, it might just be me, but I wanted to give this a go because obviously it's just a new experience in Need Speed. We need to try something new in Need Speed as soon as it drops. So there you go. The PC version has caught up. With the console version, if you're wondering, everything that's on the console version is now on the PC version, except the hot rod with manual transmission. But, we'll see, unless I'm wrong. If I'm wrong, and I've just been saying that all videos, one goes, Theo is here, I'm like, shit. I'm gonna have to do it again, aren't I? So one thing I was thinking of doing, I, I did originally want to do maybe like a, not a full-on let's play of the game, but every now and again give updates as to where I am progression-wise in the story. But, I've now basically beat one of the paths that I wanted to, and I'm halfway through another. So I thought what I might be able to do in the future is for a one-off video, just to go through all of... How did they catch me again? Bloody horror, why are, you, why are you so quick? I was thinking of maybe going through on the PC version with a wheel, go through Eddie's challenge, maybe in first-person view with the camera hack. I don't know. Make sure to let me know in the comments if you think that should be a thing. It'll be a one-off video, just doing the whole thing in one go. I think, like, an unedited video. I think, like, we might give that a go. Kind of like a Let's Play style of video, but just, as I said, in one video. I swear to Christ, you know what? I'm just going to pull over and pay the fine. I don't, I don't, shit. There we go. Pay the fine. Get out of here. You can, stop pissing me! So anyway, the hot rod is in the game. So let me know what your thoughts are on the hot rod if it's the first time for you trying it on the PC. And obviously, depending on what you're using, it's going to feel a little bit different because... Oh, what, what? Go away! <laughs> it's going to feel a little bit different because, as I said, the controller seems to be the biggest difference. You'll feel the biggest difference with a controller. With a wheel, it doesn't seem that significant, honestly, because the auto steer. But anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, please be sure to leave a like. Subscribe if you are new. And don't smash into the back of bimmers because it'll cost a fucking lot for you. All right, peace. <laughs>